Thanks for joining us this half hour. We all need some good news, right? Well, Pickens County students will see nearly $1 million in new technology thanks to a huge federal grant. The school district has also made a six-figure investment in the kids' education. Our Pickens County reporter, Asia Wilson, has the story. Well, it's exciting news for Pickens County Schools. I'm told that distance learning grant and matching funds from the school district will take their education to a new level for students inside the classroom and even students at home. Where was D-Day? Where did D-Day happen? Whether you're inside a Pickens County classroom or at home, education will look different, but in a unique way. Very grateful to receive a federal uh, distance learning grant um, to fund $845,000 um, in technology and connectivity for our schools. That grant and $150,000 in matching funding from the district will bring more than 80 clear touch screens to elementary schools in video conferencing technology. And it allows them, of course, to do all kinds of cool touch screen lessons and programs, um, but it also allows uh, another person to remotely interact with that screen. In 13 WebEx classroom kits and 11 room kit minis will go to middle and high schools, which is similar to having a live production group in class at all times. We have screens at the front and the back of the classroom uh, and, and, and microphones at the front and, and in the middle of the class so that if anybody is speaking, the cameras are on that person and even the students at home can see whoever's talking in class. William Wilson has been a part of the pilot group using the technology since last year. One of his AP students says having the new devices during the pandemic has been a game changer. Friends in this class that are online and um, at the start of the year we thought we weren't really going to get to interact with them at all, but it's nice to be able to uh, interact with them um, in the class. It's a cool and new way of doing school now and many years to come. Even students that are, are sick at home or quarantined or different things, they can tune into my class and keep going, uh, stay up with the class, don't fall behind. So there's a lot of potential with this um, new um, technology. In Pickens County, Asia Wilson, 7 News. A uh, district spokesperson says the implementation phases will happen over the next three years.